Sometimes we all feel like we're different from everyone else, maybe even weird or strange. But it's important to remind ourselves that compared to many others out there, we are very normal, no matter what we think of ourselves. So join us as we look at 10 men you really won't believe are real. Number 10. Yu Zhenhuan Yu Zhenhuan is a Chinese man who has an incredible amount of body hair, covering 96% of his whole body. Because of this, you may mistake him for a bear at distance. Yu has hypertrichosis, a rare condition also known as werewolf disease. It is believed that people in the past didn't know why a person could become so hairy, and that is where the werewolf myth came from. There are plenty of videos of Yu on YouTube and he's also appeared on TV documentaries, but he hasn't let his condition alter his way of life. One of his goals is to someday become a rock star and to become famous for something other than his looks, which I can understand. Number 9. Rolf Buchholz. I'm not personally one for piercings, but I have nothing against them either. One man certainly has a special place in his heart for piercings though. Rolf Buchholz is the most pierced man in the world and has over 450 piercings over his body. He has 94 just in and around his lips and 8 in his nose, more than 30 in his ears, 2 in his tongue and 3 in his nipples. Strangely, the highest concentration of piercings are around his man parts, 278 eight to be exact. Just thinking of that has made my man sausage shrivel up. Number 8. Paul Carson Paul Carson was not born any different. His special appearance comes from his own doing. He used to have a bad case of dermatitis on his face, which he treated by consuming a silver compound which he made himself many years ago. An unfortunate side effect of this procedure was that his skin turned blue as a result. The condition is called Argyria and it is believed to be permanent, though the effects can be somewhat reduced by staying away from sunlight. On the upside, Carson has become quite the internet celebrity and has been adopted as the one and true Papa Smurf. Number 7. Mini Me Chandra Bahadur Dangi is the smallest person alive on the planet today. He is only 1 foot 9 inches tall, all around 53 centimeters. His condition is called primordial dwarfism, which is a genetic condition that starts as early as in the womb. Not many of these dwarves exist because they experience health problems due to their small sizes, so they generally do not live beyond 30 years old. Chandra, on the other hand, is well into his 70s and believes that he is still in perfect health. Apparently, he's never even seen a doctor or taken any medication. Number 6. Mega Man Leonid may well be the tallest man on Earth. Born in 1971 in what is now Ukraine, Leonid was a normal child for the first few years, but as he became a teenager, he started rapidly growing. A brain operation at the age of 14 revealed that Leonid had a tumor on his pituitary gland, which is not accessible to doctors and so it cannot be removed. This tumor was encouraging the gland to produce loads and loads of growth hormone, which is what resulted in his crazy height. His shoe size is a euro European 62 or a 28 in the US. He weighs around 450 pounds or over 200 kilos and struggles to keep himself upright. Sadly, many health complications come with such a large size and the short lifespan can be expected. Number 5. Patrick Duell. This is a sad story. Patrick Duell was one of the, if not the heaviest person in the world at one point. The American man had a love affair with food and being a restaurant owner certainly didn't help him. At one point, he weighed in at 1,126 pounds or over 500 kilos. At one point, he hadn't left his bed for seven years because he was too large to walk anymore. He then had a gastric bypass surgery to help him lose weight and lose weight he did. He lost hundreds of pounds within a year and things were looking up. Unfortunately, once he was out of the hospital, the temptations were too much to resist and he began to eat again. He ate his way to an early grave, dying in April of 2016 at the age of 54. Number 4. Zidruna Savitskas is undoubtedly one of the strongest men on earth, arguably the strongest to ever live. The Lithuanian powerlifter is the only competitor to have won every current major strongman competition and is a four-time world's strongest man winner. Alongside that, he has won first place in the Arnold Strongman Classic eight times, Europe's strongest man three times, Giants live four times, 
and I think you get the point. He's also broken a number of world records including the log lift, giant barbell deadlift for reps, atlas stones, metal block press, hammer tire deadlift, heavy super yoke and more. Number 3 Tom Staniford. Tom Staniford is an English paracyclist who was the 2011 National Paracycling Circuit Race Champion. He suffers from an incredibly rare disorder called MDP syndrome, which has only 8 recorded cases worldwide. It affects a number of things such as his hearing, metabolism, flexibility in his limbs, testosterone levels, but most noticeably he is unable to store any fat in his body. This leaves him weighing in at only 29.9 kilos with a height of 190 centimeters. Number 2 Gary Turner His skin is so loose and stretchy he can turn his belly into a table, capable of holding 3 pints of beer. The condition he has is called Ellers Danlos Syndrome and is very rare, only affecting 1 in 10,000 people. It makes his skin twice as thin as normal people's skin and when pulled the skin can stretch out much further than usual. His talent has landed him an audition for Britain's Got Talent and he's now a performer for the royal family of strange people who are a unique collection of fascinating individuals. Number 1 Amu Haji If someone just showed you a picture, you'd think this was a troll from Lord of the Rings or some kind of CGI animated character. But no, Amu Haji is a real 80 year old man who hasn't bathed in over 60 years. He lives a very primitive life and his most prized possession is a steel pipe with which he smokes animal dung. Nobody is quite sure why he decided to stop bathing for good, but he seems happy with his dirty but simplistic lifestyle. Thank you for watching as always, let me know if you liked this video or if you thought it was like the dung Amu Haji smokes. See you next time.